One of the divides that I think has actually been very important for me to bridge is the gap between atheists and Christians in this conversation. Uh, there's a book that I think is really important. It's by Randall Rouser. It's called, Is the Atheist My Neighbor? And uh, that's like a reference to uh, you know, the story of the Good Samaritan, where it says, is the Samaritan your neighbor? And I, I, th I think that if I'm to follow Jesus, if you're to follow Jesus, if you're a Christian, I don't think we actually have a choice in our answer to that. I think the answer is that the atheist is my neighbor. And when we talk to atheists and we find out that, you know, okay, they don't agree with us about some things that we think are pretty important, but it turns out that most atheists I've found are very fair people, they're very moral. Um, I would even say that this is true of even anti-religious atheists. Um, I would even say Jerry Coyne, he is an example, I think he would gladly take on the label of being an anti-religious atheist. Uh, I, I have to say, you know, he's been very fair to me. I've really enjoyed you know, my, my conversations with him.